U.S. tests the most advanced aircraft carrier. The importance of aircraft carriers in military history cannot be overstated, aircraft carriers helped the United States win key naval battles in World War II, especially in the Pacific Theater. In the decades after World War II, aircraft carriers gave the United States the ability to project its military power across the globe. But advances in naval warfare could unseat the role of the aircraft carrier. The importance of aircraft carriers in military history cannot be overstated, aircraft carriers helped the United States win key naval battles in World War II, especially in the Pacific Theater. In the decades after World War II, aircraft carriers gave the United States the ability to project its military power across the globe. But advances in naval warfare could unseat the role of the aircraft carrier. If you want to operate aircraft carriers, you need a whole lot of high-end technology to be able to defend it, said David Larder, a naval warfare reporter for Defense News. It's been the advancement in anti-ship cruise missiles that can be launched from land. It's been advancements in cruise missiles launched from bombers or fighters that just pose an enormous threat. Aircraft carriers have been the primary capital ship of naval combat since the 1940s, and remain the currency of modern naval power. But for nearly as long as carriers have existed, navies have developed plans to defeat them. The details of these plans have changed over time, but the principles remain the same. And some have argued that the balance of military technology is shifting irrevocably away from the carrier, driven primarily by Chinese and Russian innovation. The first aircraft carrier lost to submarine attack, but would not be the last. Over the course of World War II, the United States, the UK, and Japan lost numerous carriers to submarines, culminating in the destruction of the gigantic HIJMS Shinana in 1944, this first appeared in March 2017 and is being republished due to reader interest, submarine fire torpedoes remain a critical threat to modern carriers. Russian and Chinese submarines regularly practice attacks on U.S. carrier groups, as The most important development in carrier-killing technology over the last decade has been the anti-ship ballistic missile, ASBM. The Chinese DF-21 has the potential to strike American carriers from heretofore unrealizable ranges, and threatens to penetrate existing defense systems. The missile can maneuver in its terminal phase, targeting a moving carrier on a high-velocity final approach. The kinetic energy alone of the weapon could inflict devastating damage on a flight deck, putting a carry. Thank you for watching this video if you like it don't forget to like and subscribe Detective Pop greetings from us. Thank you for watching this video if you like it don't forget to like and subscribe Detective Pop greetings from us. Thank you for watching this video if you like it don't forget to like and subscribe Detective Pop greetings from us. Thank you for watching this video if you like it don't forget to like and subscribe Detective Pop greetings from us. Thank you for watching this video if you like it don't forget to like and subscribe Detective Pop greetings from us.